everyone, and thank you for tuning in to Carrie Psychic Cafe. I am your host, Carrie Ann Hartley Sikowski. Here at Carrie Psychic Cafe, it's uh, free. It's a free call in or chat in our awesome chat room, or you can um, you could just uh, watch sit back and watch. We don't like you to do that. Uh, we uh, here at uh, Carrie Psychic Cafe, we have um, I have four awesome guardians. A little about myself. If you're a newbie and uh, you just are tuning into the show, and somebody has referred you to us, because we have a lot of referrals here. Um, we've been here around this a bit about a year now, and um, we are um, we're coming close to it's going to become a new year. And um, and we just a little bit about myself. I have four awesome guardians. I'll say their name throughout the show and they kind of help with everything. I have um, three of my family members and a doctor. So you'll be hearing me mention that. Basically what they do is talk through, I listen and then come out with the answers. It's all real, it's all believable. I have live testimonial every single week. Um, I have an awesome website. It's at www.carriepsychiccafe.com. Um, also I'm on Facebook. It's uh, Psychic uh, Medium Carrie and Hartley Sikowski. It's a long but name, but it's an awesome name to know. And uh, then we have the chat room. The chat room is a little bit different. If you're seeing this, you're not in the chat, you're missing some good, good, good chat. Our chat is like a gathering. It's like a family. We have a chat staff in there that actually calls in your questions, so it will be handled. Listen, the rules are one question, one answer. It's free. Um, basically, you can ask whatever question you want. Keep it at one minimum. There's so many people that hit, that hit up on the chat room, and phones will be popping off like, rolling um and i wanted to say uh that basically our number here is 323-792-3050 uh we're here we're live and uh we're rocking and um in the staff and in, in the staff in the chat room tonight is um aunt joan uh Susiani, and cindy um and i have the first three questions whoever came in there was people in the chat we go live at eight there's people in the chat at six o'clock this afternoon so um it definitely is hopping uh, we're going to also switch it up a little bit, hopefully, um, coming up soon. We're going to probably be cutting the show, and we're going to be doing it probably for half an hour instead of an hour. Um, we need, for web requests, we need the reason why we do this, and um, it isn't free. Uh, we pay for the show. Uh, we haven't had very many sponsors, but we and, and the web requests are not as much as we thought, um, but we're trying to work it out here. But we can always use a sponsor. It's an amazing, amazing position. If you sponsor the show or part of the show, your name goes like with the banner. And it's on every show here on Nissan Communications. We have a lot of people that have it. The hosts here are amazing. Um, this this show basically is rocking. We just started a year ago. We had no idea it would be so successful. But we need help. We need help in order to do so. Otherwise, you know, we're going to have to change other things. Also, what's coming up is uh, Carrie's Ticket Cafe is going different and better, different and, 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 and bigger things, I will tell you. Um, Air, it's A1R Radio, Psychic Radio. Um, they have a Facebook and a website. It's announced me coming into uh, their mediumship there. I'll be doing a half an hour live show uh, starting December 5th. Um, you can watch it. Uh, you can listen to it. There's none of this. So this is, whole, listen, you guys, everybody that's watching it, don't understand. A lot of these shows are not this. And do not hear question and answers all night long, okay, uh, for an hour. You don't get that normally. It, I haven't seen one show like that in the world. So this is unique, but we will be doing radio only for that one. Again, our number is 323-792-3050. Um, basically, also that call in, ask one radio.com. You can go there and look at it. They featured me on the front page, and I'm all over the place. And it's an 888 number. And, um, but, again, our show here is free, too. You could call. You could call in. You could chat in the chat room and do everything. Our condolences for um, oh God, Paul Walker. I I feel so bad. I, I don't. There's no words to explain. I totally, totally was an icon and an idol to everybody. What happened was tremendously, tremendously damaging to a lot of people. And we say that we ask him to be put in our prayer chain here. <clears throat> we got a couple incidences that happened around my area that we've lost several people. Please keep them in mind and keep them into the into your hearts. You'll see my aunt Joan in the chat room today. She's not feeling too good. She's taking some kind of medication. And my father just wants her to know immediately before I start this show that what procedure they're doing and how you're doing it and what's going into your body. Um, and, and as far as the aches and pains, and I know with the arthritis, but um, Aaron said there's a different type of medication that can be given in order for you not to have the deck to counteract because it's just not reacting the right way. So we want you to... Uh, to get that um, ASAP done because we need, I need you around. And I love you very much. My family is very supportive. I have Amon. Hi, Amnon. Hello, Gary. How are you? I'm awesome, awesome. Hey. And uh, we have Nick on the phones that's going to be screening your calls and taking them in. Remember, it's one question, one answer, and uh, it's 323-792-3050. Amnon, we have, um, I have several questions already, but do you want to? No, we phone? don't have anybody on the phones yet. 
Awesome. Okay, so, so what we're going to thank you so much. So what we're going to do is we're going to answer some chat questions. Again, it, it's holiday. Happy holidays to everybody. Hope everybody had a happy Tucker Day. Um, and I hope that everybody has a um, has a great, great week. Um, but um, I will tell you that um, it is a holiday and it is a Sunday. So it might be a little, so, which is fine because we will hit it no matter what. Um, Natalia, oh, what a beautiful name. Natalia, I have court in the morning and I am wondering if I'm going to be, it's going to be in my favor or not. Well, my grandmother said, you got this. So that's my motto. Um, basically, but you will be a little, you're, you're nervous as hell. Wow, you got to calm down, sweetheart. Uh, you're nervous as hell because you understand, thank you. They, they say, my dad also says that, Natalia, you have some things that you need to change also in your life in order to make it better. And we're not just throwing it down at you, but when you win this and when you move forward with this, it will build your whole who you're going to be now. It's going to change you completely. Uh, and then there's Melissa. What do you see for my future relationship? Hi, Melissa. You get the, this is a long question. I suggest, uh, I've, oh, I forgot to say about the super special for December, uh, 10 for 10. If you book 10 minutes, you get, it's for $10. You can go to the PayPal and go right through. You don't have to have PayPal in order to book the reading. Um, yes, uh, you do. <sighs> this guy, as far as, the, I mean, I'm sorry, the partner, thank you, my grandmother, the partnership that's going on or, or what it is to be, it needs men, it needs to build it needs to grow it needs to thank you it needs to express love it needs to make breathe in breathe out because you really really need to take your time um the problem with some things that go on with you is that um when you act out and do things you have to kind of sometimes think first before you think you before you do my my father says you're awesome person you're an awesome person you just gotta learn but don't um as far as uh the future goes with with the relationship whatever uh, you have to learn to also love thank you they're talking about loving yourself and owning it. So something happened and something went down that you that you need some you need somebody to take you by and just tell you how wonderful you are. And that's me. That's us tonight. You're an awesome, awesome person, Mal. You really are. Smiles. Uh, there's a guy I do really like, and we have been friends for many years now. I was wondering if there was any potential for a potential for a relationship. This is a question. Okay. Um, well, that's just all my hand. Yeah, I understand that. <laughs> I understand that. I don't know. I'm sorry, everybody. But tonight, I'll tell you right now, from like almost three and a half to four hours, I've had my hands are freezing. I've had something around me that is just not right. It's 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 counteracting. It's it's not being very nice. And it's not talking to us, which makes me, the Guardians, very protective. So I'm just I'm throwing that out there. So I'm trying to make everything happen today. But, um, but as far as... Friends are great. I mean, but you, you're going to really have to push this situation if you want it to be a rise to a situation where you would want like a forever. You need to understand also that there is something around you that doesn't allow you to always give 100%. You have to learn that you will not be hurt. So um, if you open up your heart, thank you, and open up your mind. My, my, my father says that, um, Joe and Boy, too, they agree. I, that's my guardians. They said that um, you can't look at sometimes the past. You just got to go forward. You can't do that. It's not going to work out for you. Our number here is 323-792-3050. Again, you could call in or you could chat in our awesome chat room. And Amon, just let us know when you get a phone call, please. So what's going on in chat there, Toots? Do you want to talk to Susie Annie? Sure, that'd be awesome. Chat's really hot, everybody. You should hit on chat. Chat's awesome. You go to www.carriesegecafe.com, click on the link, and go on to the show, and then get into the chat. Hey, Suziani. Hi, Carrie. How you doing? You look beautiful tonight. How was your Thanksgiving? It was gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Along with my family. Yes. I went. I was with my children, actually, in Freehold, New Jersey. And we went up to the Grazio's house and my uh, ex-husband's uh, father. And, um, well, they're my, my daughter's grandparents. And they're just beautiful people. And we had a great time. Tom had his kids. And uh, they were here. And we went up there. It was different this year. It was really awesome. How was your Thanksgiving? That sounds How was <laughs> Yeah. Did you um did you spend it with anybody in particular that you were fond of or Oh, just my little Gigi stopped by in the morning to wish me a happy oh. Thanksgiving and have a slice of pie with me. But other than that I was it was a very quiet day for me, but I needed to rest because I had two seven year olds here on Wednesday and one oh. on Friday, so that was okay. <laughs> Well, I'm saying you got all those kids coming over to your house. That sounds fun. You do a lot. Of, you're, you're a very good person, Susiana. You really are. You're like a little angel. Um, everybody doesn't know Susiana. Uh, I just, those kids keep me young, Carrie. I'm telling you, but you're wonderful with them. It's just all about you. So 
you know, and you're helping this Gigi gluten free and me. This is a greater concept for children also with the, with the situation, even though Gigi doesn't have it. Um, and you do, uh, so, but you have to, and they just love the idea. The whole concept could just go national. So you got to keep on that, you know, the, all those, those recipes and all those things that you do and how you're teaching her is a reason because she might meet up with or come across or have a child that needs this kind of help. So you're prepping this young girl for something that she's going to come into in her life. So that's what the guard, that's what my grandmother says all the time for you. So you, who is pe the people that you help in your life, you always set them up for something that they're going to do later. But you've always been good like that. So, all right, let's start our questions, my that's dear. That's what I'm here for, Carrie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to, I, I, my, my grandmother's been wanting to say that for so long, too. I'm like, finally, we have a moment where it's going to be Susiana time. So, all right, let's, let's okay, hear it, baby. Okay, so anyway. We have Dennis in chat, and I think, I don't know, um, he's Georgia, oh, his ex-wife was Georgia O'Connor, she's a medium, medium also, mm -hmm. and he says that his father always takes over, so he expects that is, when, I, when I ask, is, uh, uh, is his father with you? Well, his father's not with me. Uh, my father's with me. My father says that what's going on with the kids is what he wants to know about him. So if he can answer in the questions, uh, my father wants to know what's what the hell's going on with, with the children. That's exactly what he said. So, um, and he doesn't say that much. Something's up. Something's up. So does he have a question or does he want to just talk? No, I said, did you want to, was your question that, was there any messages? And he said, no, my father will take over and whatever. Yeah. And so that's what he said. Yeah, he's got, I want to, my father's more concerned with what's going on, um, and the fact of the matter is that he just got to watch that cholesterol, but he's got to watch, there's, there's something up with, with family life, there's something going on, and, and there's something to, uh, something about abandonment and something about discouragement, and he cannot, he has to keep focused, stay focused, and dad, dad loves him very much, but if dad wants to get his butt out of his butt, his head out of his butt, and let him know that he's there for him, he's always going to be there for him, but he's got to take charge, because there's so many things that are wrong legally too and i'm feeling money thank you my grandma confirms it so and the next question Susiani, i hope i helped him he didn't okay um the next one is from um and bill g um mm -hmm. who's also with hilltop he's hilltop um because of his health uh the farm that him and his wife have lived on for the uh, last 23 years um, they were thinking of selling it, but his son, who's in the Army but gets out next year, says that he'll take it over. Um, any insight on this? Oh, thank you. They, they, my, oh, boy, they all said at the same time. That, that's what needs to be done. But there's a problem with financially keeping up with it until then. So somebody needs to come up with some money because it's a money issue. And there's health. I know that he can't keep it up, but absolutely. But somebody has to help you out some way. You got it. Oh, thank you. Some farmer's fund. Something's out there. Oh, thank you. So my father says you go to www.farmersfund.com, and there's something on there. Thank you. Now you're going to tell me websites. This is too funny. There's something on there that, that goes goes through that he could actually apply for and get help for in order because he's a little bit behind with some stuff. But, Bill, listen. Your health is a bit is an issue, but your wife is everything is will be. Aaron keeps on bringing up a pneumonia based fluid in the lungs and underneath the lungs. So I'm just letting you know that there's something going on there with the lungs. Be careful, please. And the next one, Suziani. Thank you. Okay, the next one is from Green Eyed Lady, and Hi. don't ask me why, but this question makes me nervous. Okay, so I'm just telling you that right now. Well, I a gentleman message. Mm -hmm. A gentleman messaged her on Facebook and wants to get to know her. She says, you have liked his picture, but you are not friends with him. She, she finds it suspicious because of her old boyfriend, who was a scam artist, I guess. And so uh, is he genuine? She can't no. find anything about him on the Internet except bad stuff, and he says that bad stuff is about somebody else. No, that's the, this is, this is, this is a scam. No, thank you. No, thank you. Uh-uh. No, something Paul. I don't know what his name is, but they're saying something. My father's bringing up the name Paul. I don't know why or something to do with that. And you need to understand that it's just his face and there's nothing behind it. And he's a scam artist. Do not be around him. Do not be. There's like, there's, there's only three for names. Thank you. Please. My father's red alert, red alert. No. Should no. you block him? Should yes. you block him? Yes. 
There's three names he has. Absolutely, yes. And it's, it's not good. It's not good. This guy does not exist. And wow. she said, yes, it was Paul. You're right. It was Paul. She just, I just looked at chat. Thank you. Bingo. That's what we do here. We're real. Okay, the next one, Suziani. Oh, um, no, the next one, the next one will be, um, Aunt Jones got the questions okay. next. Okay. So okay. I was just, thank later. you, Lovey. I'll talk to you later, Lovey. Um, I was just <laughs> wondering if everybody heard that, whoever's listening or talking in a chat, that this is real. This is like totally, totally 100% legit. So, you know, we just, I have four awesome guardians. Like, you book a reading. You want to know your future? You want a Christmas gift? $50. For the it's it, it's just it's just a, a gift that's worth giving a gift of knowledge. It's twenty minutes for fifty, 20 minutes for 50 dollars. It's a it's a certificate. It's beautiful. But you give the gift of giving. I mean, it's unbelievable. And uh, any other calls, Amnon? Or we're good? We have Aunt Joan. I love her. Okay. Hi, Aunt Joan. Hi, sweetheart. How are you? Uh, I'm okay. Daddy's concerned about you. Very concerned. Why, what's the matter? Why, because when I on? first. Were, when I first went on to the, when I first came, I couldn't take, I couldn't say the number or anybody's chat questions because he's talking about the treatment you're getting as far as reacting to, to not, your body's not reacting to it. It's like, it's not reacting to anything. It's actually against you. It's rejecting, Aaron, it's rejecting the medication. Because Aaron makes me have this horrendous taste in my mouth over it, but we're going to figure out what needs to be done in order to, there's like a different brand that would not do this. And they're talking about Benadryl. He keeps on saying to me that something about Benadryl before you were to take this infusion, that Benadryl would counteract it and you would not feel this way and you might be able to get it to work. So he just wanted to let you know that. He's going to go with you. Now, Daddy, my father's with her. Con. This is my aunt, everybody in the world that's listening. And she also has an ability. But since we've been doing this, my dad and her were brother and sister, for the first time viewers and everything. And when my aunt gets on the phone, boy, they go nuts, my sister and my father. So um, so do you want to do the questions, my love? I just had to tell you that because he's been saying it over and over again. So. Oh, yeah, because um, that's what... Um the doctor i had asked her about the benadryl and they do give me benadryl but in pill form and i my body rejected the medication twice and right. then they had to shoot more benadryl in me but she wants to go a different route so okay, uh, it's good. in god's hands yeah, whatever so, best well, for me absolutely and it will happen i'm just concerned about that benadryl he's he was t- keep on talking about benadryl so at least we confirmed that again yeah. so all well, right it took so away the reaction got? immediately okay let's get on with the people Okay, right. April. She, she's awaiting um, an answer on her settlement, and she was Who's wondering, will she get it, and will she be happy with this settlement? Well, my grandma and my they, they both agree. They both agree with the fact that the, the numbers are that are going to be a lot different than what you're agreeable to. A deposition, thank you, everything, what else? The number, they're showing me the number, oh, wow. You're getting a substantial amount of money. You definitely are. If you could live with almost a half a million dollars or a little bit more, I think you'd be very happy. I think you could life could be very good. And the, thank you. And medical benefits covered. Something's up with medical. Something. Oh, oh, oh. Bills. Sorry. Sorry. To medical bills. Um, they need to be paying them too. And the next one, Aunt Joan. Okay. The next one is from Ann W. And she wants to know if she has any messages from her mother, as she is missed, very missed. Uh, my father says talking about a granddaughter something about a granddaughter that she talks to all the time and she goes to all the time and she's always with you um she sees the sadness and sees and hears the and all i keep hearing i keep on hearing um the dance by garth brooks but i keep on hearing with your mother she's in a happy place but she's not happy uh, you have to understand that she had to go through a, a turmoil of her own, whatever happened with herself. It all came, when you go up, you, it all comes through. My father keeps on showing me a while of opening pictures that all she misses is, is, is what went on in her life and what it was about and, and everything. The holidays are not easy. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to cry. The holidays, my nose is going. Boy, oh, boy, the woman, the woman is, uh, was a great woman. But you have to also understand, oh, God. 
All right, thank you. Um, you have to watch, there's a problem, there's a recall with your vehicle that you're driving, and we have to be very, very careful with your brake pads because they're going on a low basis. So they keep on showing a warning notice regarding whatever vehicle you're driving. You need to call wherever it came from and what, what's on the, the thing in order to get it done because there's something with their, and, well, okay, the rotors too. There's something rubbing, rubbing, keep on feeling rubbing. And the next one, Aunt Jo? Okay, the next one is from Mickey Ann One. And she said, Carrie, please, did my twin sister, Amory, know about me? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. We need to investigate that more because, see, I hear, I, Jesus. I really uh, feel that there's more to this picture, Mac. There's more to this picture. We talk anyway. We'll talk about it. But I'm telling you, there's more to this picture. There's, 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 there's a whole life you need to know about. And the next one, Aunt Jo? Okay, that's it. But um, as you know, we're we're asking for prayers for Hague's family, for her oh, husband please. and children, since she yes, passed please. away this week. So I'm asking everybody to please pray for this family. They really need prayers. Oh my God, this is devastating. And and we're going to put it out there in the room again. Please put her name and anybody that can start the prayer chain for this woman and these children that devastatingly happened. I've been a mess about it all weekend. So um, it's it, it's yeah, in the uh, curlies in the room. Carly's in the room and, and knows her, her very good friend that, that actually just lost it. I mean, it's just tragic. When things go wrong in life and something happens so tragically, it makes you step back and wonder and see how powerful your life is and how impact your life is to other people. My aunt and I were just talking about it before the show because we talked before the show about like how I could never leave my children or family, the, the children, because how would they exist? How would they move forward? Like, how would they live without calling me or, you know what I'm saying? And my aunt agreed with me. Like, this is why we do the prayer chain also, because aunt, my aunt will light the candle. But these children are devastated. The mother just is dead. And no one's ever coming back. And, and that's the biggest part is that you can, you can never feel the horror in that. Never. And you will only get one mother. And um and, and this is what the upset is for this for this beautiful family that now has absolutely positively uh no hope right now. So um so prayers, thank you, and Joan. Let's put her name in there and get as many much help as I can for her and the family. Yes. And uh, all right, I love you. Thank you so much for calling in. I love thank you too, you. honey. I guess Curly's gonna call in next. Okay. All right, all right. awesome. All right, awesome. bye, honey. Thank you. Bye. Um, again, it's three two three seven nine two three oh five oh when tragedy hits and, and look at the trains. Yep. Look what happened just now. People lost their lives from Thanksgiving Day. Are you serious? The world is so crazy. You gotta love each other. You gotta and if you're not happy, you're not content, you need to move on. If you're not if you're not doing what you gotta do to, to even make yourself happy, you gotta find a way to make yourself happy, everybody out there. You can't no longer not be happy because if something happens just like that, there's nothing left but you know, you gotta everybody in the world needs to love and, and to be happy. The train derail. And and it, yeah, the train derail. I just it's unbelievable. Um, and again, you know, our number is 323-792-3050. I knew it wasn't going to be that much of a hopping show, but, you know, at least it'll be rest. Do we have another, any cool, more calls here? Mary, Mary Lou. Hi, Mary Lou. Hi, Carrie. Hey, beautiful. How are you What's tonight? Up? I'm Good. awesome. Um, my have? question is, uh, I feel like I have so many different directions that I, I need to go to, but I'm not sure what's really pulling me, you know, between family, Christmas, relationships what what do you see for me um i see a total thank you my, my father says a total redirection a total clear in the slate i mean you have a great the relationship that you're in um is substantial but is it is it, it are you in a relationship that's all i want to know because i feel no. like you're, you're just I'm airy not. to me and you and they're just like forget it huh um because there's just you know in, in christmas the time of year is really hard for somebody like you who has many things that needs to be done. Um, but you need to take one day mm. at a time to tell me because you don't get stressed out about anything, anything. And definitely, thank you. My father said somebody's coming your way, but we got to leave the door open in order to get there. Um, but, uh, mm -hmm. I mean, like, new direction. I mean, new, new year, new beginning. They, they see everything as far as financial because you need some help. Financial, um, as far as relationship gain, as far as, like, you know, mental health, as far as taking care of yourself, getting yourself adjusted. You're getting there, Mary. You just you just all got everything on. You know, like, you're like a, you're juggling. Look, some guy just yeah. stop. You got to stop. You got to let it go because I feel your tension. And when I feel it, it's real. I'm telling you. And my grandma's like, right. you're too beautiful. You got too much going for you to worry about so much. Really. Um, you know, like it, it, it becomes sessions. Like you should get involved with somebody that can help you as far as put things together for you. Um, life coach. That's mm -hmm. what I have. 
There's nothing wrong with that. I mean, they're suggesting help as far as you getting some help in order to put things in order. Um, I mean, we can direct you. It's good to have somebody to talk to about it all the time. You need to get some stuff out. Right. No, I need you to talk about it. I need you to talk about it. Okay. So they're suggesting communication, open communication with somebody. I have an awesome, if you email me, I have an awesome referral for Life Coach, who I use. And she's awesome. Okay. Yeah, and we do psychic sessions. I mean, that's also a thing too that we work too. But I'll, I'll give you, um, I'll give you definitely a heads up on an amazing, amazing life coach. Her name is Marilyn Channing. She also has a show here, and she's awesome. She takes care of okay. a lot of people. Thank you, baby. Thank you so much. Okay, um, thank you. Thank you. Um, three two three seven nine two three zero five zero. You could call in. You could chat in our awesome chat room. We don't like you just to watch and listen. Um, you know, I mean, it is what it is. You know, it, here, what can we? Who's on the phone there, Ann? Anybody? Curly. Hey, Sin, what's up? Hi. I'm, I'm losing my picture. You're good. Oh. All right. How you doing, babe? Hold on one second. Turn off sound. What okay. does it say here? One second. What does it mean here to Just do that? Well, well, okay. All right, go ahead. Even though I'm blurry. Yeah, okay, I'm blurry. Uh, yeah, I don't know what. That's the internet. Don't worry. Okay. What's up, babe? Okay, the first question is from Rosemary. Okay. Uh, she went to the doctor, and he told her the cancer is stage four. Okay. She's, well, she's no. favoring you. She starts chemo this week. Right. And if you have any insights from your guardians. Yeah, that's wrong. She's not that. She's going to be fine. They have total confidence in this. Hit that chemo hard, baby. You're, you're gonna, it's going to take you down a little bit, but we're here for you. We're definitely here for you. No. I can't believe that. Erin is not believed that at all. No, there's, there's, there's not that, it's not as, as, I don't care what anybody's, thank you. Aaron's like, this is, he's adamant about it. No, 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 no. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. This will, this one, this will, this shall pass. But you're going to have to go through some stuff in order to do that. But I know for a fact that you'll be fine. I would not tell you, let me tell you something. We don't do death. I mean, that's God's work. But I will tell you that if the, if Aaron had any possibility, and we've told people that we're getting treatment that have been going on a success route, that there's are certain things that we need to also understand and do. Um, but you just the, the, mentioned something about COBOL. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means, so if you want to look that up. But something to do with as far as getting into it and getting it done and getting it out and getting it over with. Um, and if you help have anybody in your life essentially to walk you through this, we are here for you. We will always be here for you. We will never let you go. And you will always be in the para, para group. It does work. Keep faith. And let me tell you something. I have four some guardians, and they will not going to let you down. And the next one's in. I, I, I feel so bad. Um, it's from Sharon. Hi, Sharon. Um, she, she wants to know anything on her sister Karen. They haven't spoken in 15 years. My grandmother says um, irreconcilable differences. They're just different. You're, 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 it's, oh, God. Okay. And they said that she's not, thank you. Joey based on my cousin, he's, she's not at fault for any of the, of the battle. But the only fault that this is is that there's just too much distance now. So uh, within one, two, three, I'd say three months, uh, give or take, somebody needs to exchange something as far as a communication gap here. Um, and I will let you know that your sister, there is stuff going on with her situation and relationship, and she has some kind of issue going on with her health-wise. So I suggest very much so, and this is a heads up for you today on this show, is that you reach out and you say to her, no matter under what circumstances, I want to have you back in my life. And just call her out. And, and whether you did it or not a hundred times, a thousand times, you're showing me all these times, just do it again. It will work. Well, thank you. It will work. And the next one, Carl? Um, it's from Annette. Hi, Annette. And mm-hmm. she wants to know, do you see her and her children's father ever working things out and getting back together? No. Thank you. Absolutely not. That you are on another journey. Um, there's, there, thank you. <laughs> my aunt, my, my, my grandmother said, don't, don't, you don't, you need to throw out those old shoes. Okay. Like you can re-innovate because there's, they tell me that there's somebody else that's about to or around to around you. So you have to understand that you have to keep focused on what's important as a children, but what's important, whether he wants to get back, get back or not, you can't change somebody who ha- won't want to change themselves regardless of what he's done or how, why the relationship is no longer. There's a reason. And there's your side, his side, and then there's the truth. That's what she keeps saying to me. But I'm just going to let you know something, my love. you got to just move on forward. That's all we beg you to do. That would be best. And any you have any more, Carl, or you're good? Um, No, that was it. Okay, babe. Thank you. I'll talk to you later. All right. Uh, all right. Bye-bye. What's that? 
Oh, okay. I have to slow down and explain why nope. I look to the left. Go ahead. Why somebody else? Just All right. Some people are asking about why you're looking to your left. Oh, wait. I have four guardians, and, and I say thank Jersey. you. Oh, I need to slow. This is who I am. I'm sorry. Um, I talk fast because I have four awesome guardians that talk sometimes the same time independently. I'll mention their names. I look up. I say thank you. This is where the direction of the sound. This is exactly where the cold and freezing. This is exactly where they are, and I just thank them because without them, this would not be happening. So that's what I mean by it's real. It's all real. I'm I'll try to slow down a little bit. That's really hardy I'm not to slow down. So, um, <laughs> and on knows. He's like, oh, yeah. yeah. All right. And uh, do we have any more phone calls? Or yep. we're going to have a nice oh, slow? Okay. All uh, right. I mean, if you, want, if you want to take some other questions from Tom, go ahead. No, no. We're good? No, we're, we're good. good. Okay. We're so talk with, oh, nice uh, talk with Mary. Hey, Mary. Hi. How are you? I'm awesome. How you doing? Very good, thank you. Well, we're just wondering. We have a ghost in our house, and we and we, we've kind of seen it, but we don't know if it's going to leave us or stay with us. Okay. Um. It came up. Mary, I can't. Do you have a problem with with a bronchial or something to do with your chest? I feel very heavy chest to talk to you. Aaron talking to something about bronchitis or any any type of asthmatic situation. Your house, your house has issues in it. Your house has some mold in it. Just so you know, you need to be aware. Real oh. quick, you need to be aware. Okay. Be aware, and don't be around anybody that. I mean, when you come in and you stay in your house and you've been, thank you. Where is it at? It's starting from underneath, uh, and it's gross. It's just, I'm sorry, they're just telling me where it's coming from so we can get this taken care of so you don't get sick. So it's but more of okay. an undergrowth that's underneath the house that's starting. But as far as the ghost is concerned, it comes with the house and it stays with the house. That's a woman. Okay. But I'm just going to let you know something. Just be careful with that. Don't do any, any stuff to conjure it or anything. Let it kind of be. It kind of lives among its own world. And there's a couple more in there you're just not aware of. So, you know, where are you located uh, at? Where are you calling from? Uh, in Army. Oh, you're a party. Okay, so how have you had any? Yeah. Have you thought about having any team come in and try to get it on on camera? Uh, no. You should. No. Yeah. Why? You, yeah. Why not? I gotta. There's I'll look you. Plenty of paranormal. I got a team. Oh, oh my God! Absolutely, I can hook you up with somebody to get that done. Because I have a strong feeling there's more mm -hmm. than one. So I'm not trying to spook you out, but we could definitely get them on camera. I mean, I know a lot of people, so uh, I, I can get a team out there if you're willing to do it. It's just dead time, it's called. And they just sit there, they set up the cameras. And if you got that baby on tape, that would be good for you. You could use it. Uh-huh. Yeah. It, would it be, it, it's not like a, one of my relatives that it's somebody uh, else it, that's been here. It, yeah. 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 You're a great, you, you, have a, you have guardians around you, but what's in your house comes with your house and stays with your house. So I'm just letting you know that. Oh, wherever okay. You live. It's not going anywhere, but it does, it can spook you out because as you talk about it and you encourage it to come more, it can get stronger. It can look, if you're already seeing it, it's pretty strong. Yeah, it wants to be noticed. It wants okay. to be, you know, I, I, it wants I, to I've seen a head. Well, oh, then I would be careful. And I would just smudge, you would need to get a smudge stick from Mystical Magical World and, and Lynnhurst, that's my store. Um, go there, get your smudge stick and ask them for sea salt and light the white candle. And Carl Curley's okay. in the room. Are you in the chat room today or no? Yes. Okay. If you're in the chat room, there's a girl, Cindy Figlia. She's, I mean, she's Curly. She'll tell you where the store's at. Ask Cindy to tell her where the store's at for Mystical World. She goes there all the time. Thank you so much for calling in, babe. I'll, email me. Okay, at the, uh, email, click above my head and email me because I can get your name of a team if you want to do that. I just would need to, to get okay. you in touch. With you. All right. Thank you. Um, okay. How do you book? Me? All right, how thank you. You? Take, you go to www.carriepsychiccafe.com, and if you're not watching all this tonight and listening to all this fastness and greatness, then you need to then go to. You can click above my head, and I have a website. And how do you book a reading? You book a reading by going to the website and clicking book a reading and or services. And uh, there's a little bit of a button down there that's a PayPal button that you get. You don't have to have PayPal to use a PayPal button. We always ask the cast and everybody asks all the time. Again, turn my head. You will go through PayPal to just use your credit card. You could use credit card, credit card, any kind of credit card we take. But I just wanted to make okay. that very clear live. But people are saying, well, I don't. you don't have to have the PayPal. You can have any major credit card or bank card or whatever. And is there another phone call, Am? 
Yeah, and I'm trying to figure out the name. It's either Elika or Erica. Okay. Erica. Erica. Hi, Erica. Hi, Carrie. Hey. How are you? What's up, friend? I'm awesome. What can we do for you tonight? Um, well, this is my first time calling. And oh, thank I you. had a question Welcome. about my dad. All right. No. Um, you know, if there was any, any messages about him in particular. Oh, wow. My dad brings him in. He, he, he just, um, well, well, number one, sorry. Number one, I could cry. Number one, missing everybody, missing you. Um, uh, is there any siblings? Yeah, one. Okay. Is it a boy or a girl? You mean his sibling or my sibling? His. Is one, it a, is there, a are they still alive? Yeah, they're still alive. Okay, because he's mentioning the sibling that he goes to all the time, and he wants to mention the fact that he wants them to acknowledge him so he could come in even more. There's something There's something up here. There's a message that needs to be done, but it needs to be directly for that sibling. And that sibling's not well. There's something up. And it, it's a wake-up call, basically. Hmm. You have to understand something. You have to watch your driving big time. Be careful. Yellow doesn't mean green, and you have to watch when you do interchanging because whether you know it or not, your your preliminaries for your for your, your what do you what are you saying? Oh, my doctor's talking vertical. Okay. So sometimes whether you know it or not, there's sometimes there's like a shutter. There's like um when you're looking to your left and your right, whether you're knowing it or not, you're par- when you're looking to make this way, or you're looking to make that way. You you you're it's something's not correct right there. You need to be more focused because he's very concerned about there's they're very well, especially mine, very concerned about driving. Um, and as far as there's going to be something to do with a career opportunity or, or time more money. So if there's money all around you. You have to know how to get it. And it's after it's like around July. Oh, I was going to say January 20th because they're saying the 21st, but I'll say a day before because that's what I feel. There's an opportunity coming and it's more on a focal of, of what you love to do and want to do. Um, and I would suggest that you 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 think about it, you do it, and you go forward with it. Uh, what's going on with a rela- with any relationship? They're bringing up you. There's all heart around you, so they're bringing up love. So, what is there anything that could happen for you, or is happening? No, <laughs> not at all. There needs there needs to be because you you have to open up your eye and not be so negative about it because there's something that's around or something because they're bringing up a friendship versus love ship. So there's something that comes combined. But just keep your open up your mind, keep your open up your heart, because I'm just letting you know that it's gonna. It's I feel you and I see a heart around you. When we do that and we feel that way, it's happening. So you need to keep yourself open for that. Okay. Thank you so much for calling okay. in. So thank you so much. Thank Have a you. beautiful, beautiful holiday. Thank you. Our number here is three two three seven nine two three zero five zero. We're here. We're live and we're rocking. We're trucking through this day so you know what time is it anyway oh it's 8 3 okay all right um also everybody a little bit of announcement i'm gonna do uh is that we're gonna start closing up the show at like five up so i'm gonna then i'll start throwing down everything just a little bit we're gonna get control over the show a different way and the next call i'm um Susie Annie. hey babe I know hi you how you doing <laughs> i'm great um, my nose is so itchy i i I just, I wanted to tell you that, um, remember when Chris Setterston a couple of weeks ago asked about a project mm-hmm. and you said it was all good? Well, Uh-oh. you were correct. Huh? Okay. You were right. And, uh, um, Chris just wanted to let you know that. Thank you, Chris. I love her. And uh-huh. she has a great show on mm-hmm. Wednesday. I'm going to be on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Paranormal Mojo. Paranormal Mojo. On what day it is? Wednesday night. Wednesday night. Everybody needs to tune in. I just had somebody um, that needs a paranormal team that come to Kearney, New Jersey. If she knows anybody, Chris, in the room, or does she know anybody that would be able to do that location? Um, I have a woman that has some pretty powerful ghosts in there. So there you go. And everybody got to She's awesome. I, I love Chris. I love everything she does. And she's a great human being. Um, you don't find them that, like, like that much. You know that? No more. And Laura, too. Laura's, well, they all both are. Everybody on that set is great. You made the right decision and the right choice to go to that other place, too, just so you know my, my father said. Um, you know what? You're fantastic at what you do, but your criteria has to be, you have to go a little bit, you have to pull your bar up a little bit more, Chris. St- don't, th- thank you. My father says, do not, do not, you have to bring her up so they're going to read her. 
Um, you can't you can't second guess what you do. You got to just go forward with it. That this is the new beginning, and the new year is a new beginning for you. Go for it. Take it. Take it to the next level because you're so damn good at what you do. Please do that. And the next one, Suziani. Um, they're saying there's a question from Janet. <laughs> <laughs> and telling me to take the question, but okay, um, I'll ask her to retype it. So I'm going to okay. tell you, uh, Christine has a question that just popped up. Okay. Um, okay. Let's see. She had another blood clot while taking yeah. blood thinners, and the doctors are baffled. Do you see? Do you see anything? What do you say? Um. I uh, I want you to, to uh, I want you to go to the hospital, because you have something that's not right, and they need to find out what's wrong with you. And he's saying something about um, it's a it's a it's 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 the reaction of the of the medication. It's the reaction of what's going on in your body. You're going through a transition, and he's bringing up another clot. And I don't like where the clot is heading. So I don't know what they're doing or what the hell they can't do right. But there's something wrong here, and I need you to get help. Immediately. And I will call you after the show. Sorry. This is my best friend. Um, and the next one, Suziani, sorry. Um, there gonna, doesn't seem to be anything right at the moment, but I want to say that mm-hmm. that people should book readings as Christmas gifts for people, Hanukkah gifts, whatever. Thank Birthday you so gifts, much. I don't... I, the, the deal that you have going on, I mean, that, I mean, what a fabulous gift to give to somebody. I just think that's an amazing gift. I mean, you give somebody answers to what they've been searching for, whether they believe in it or not. Just one reading with me will change. I can't stress enough. I mean, I really, we do this every week. We help hundreds and hundreds of people. I mean, it's just one question. Could you imagine if you had a reading? I mean, I just, I just don't understand. I don't understand. We want to keep the show. We want the show to rock, Susie. We want to do everything we can, but we need people to, to understand that they need more help. I can't do, we can't do everything in one hour. You know, so we try. Yeah, everybody, we so try. We so try. I want to help everybody. That's why I started the show a year ago. I want to help yeah. the world. I want everybody to know that this is exists. This is real. And we help people. I have a doctor that's a that's a guardian for crying out loud. I mean, I, without them, I don't know what I'd be. But I'm just telling you, I mean, I mean people got to get I help. Mean, Carrie, you 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 do help people every week. Thank you. I don't know if people read the testimonials online or not, but there's always testimonials. People are always saying, you know, and thanking you, and 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 it's it's amazing how many people you have been and sharing your gift like that. But you know, a reading does so much more than what you can do here, and people really need to understand that. I think that's the whole concept we're not getting through. Is that it's great to ask one question. But if, if you have to, like, wait every week to ask that one question, book a reading and get your life changed immediately. I make so many offers right. and so many deals that people could afford it. I, you know, there's, the world needs to be helped, and I can't do it if you guys don't reach out. I mean, it's one show. And what happens if we just don't do the show if something happens? I mean, who else is going to get help? Who else does this? I don't know. I've searched. People have searched. There's no show like this, Suze. I don't know where there was, is one that does this. And it's live testimonial. It's life, everything. And, you know, I, 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 I've been here a year. I must be doing something right. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, yes, and we got yes. people like Suziani, and we got great people. I mean, we have great people all over the world that join us. And again, our, our, I think the chat room Suze, is a gathering more so than anything. Uh, people, yes. I mean, they, they love each other. They take care of each other. They help each other out. How many people help each other out in the chat rooms, right? So, oh, and, I mean, and the best people, the best people come to chat. I'm telling you, you could sit there and watch and listen all you want, but all you got to do is, is, is make, some people don't want to know, but the ones who don't want to know are the first ones that whenever you have a reading, you're like, bam, you know? So, I mean, there's things in people's lives that, that, that need to be adjusted and changed, and, and we can do that help you. But thank you for making that point of the Christmas gift, because it's a gift that keeps on giving. Thank you, Suziani, yeah. so much. Okay, thank there's you so two, much. two more, two more, um, <laughs> there is two questions now. Okay. And then um, I think Unique Chris might also be on hold to ask a question. But uh, um, Janet Ackerland um, oh. wants to know if she has a, a guardian angel. Yeah, she's from Sweden, just so you know. I'm trying to stop 
the nose thing. It's a it's a tick, I think. Um, but uh, when I get when I get like all hyper and everything, but um, yes, absolutely. It's your grandfather, and and thank you. My father said that you have to medication that you're taking and, and what you're arising. Everything's gonna go work out for you. It's we're not just shining it up so it looks really big, shiny, big ball for you. But I'm telling you, Janet, everything's gonna work out for you. And this year coming, financially better for you too. There's th there's things that you've been waiting for that's finally coming through, like money. Okay, and you can't. You got to, like, you can't help everybody in the world like you want to, especially your family. You have to take care of who's inside of you, and we want to make you well here so you could do it out and give and share it to the world because you want to help everybody, and we got to help you. So we're here for you, and it's your grandpa. And next, and do you have another one in there? Or is, is, you need Chris yes, on the line? Yes, Chris, Chris, Chris Sederston but, says she's starting a new, a new real nursing job Tuesday to help pay for all the fun things. And <clears throat> that that don't pay so good. So how's it going to go for her? She's going to be all right. She's going to be all right. It's all changing for you. It's all good. It's all good. And stay with the the stay with what you're doing because you enjoy it. The the nursing is just something that you're damn good at. I mean, you know, you just you just skilled at it, and you're especially skilled at people who don't understand what's going on with them. You're very calming and understanding, and you get the point to them correctly. Aaron said. So, and you got to take care of your health, too. There's all smoke around here. I don't know what's going on. Be careful. Um, and anything else there, or there's want me to talk to you, Nick Chris? No, I, I think you might have calls on hold, so I'm going right, to let you thanks, go. All right, thanks, Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, good night. Good night. Good night, love you. All right. And, um, Amon, do we have any calls waiting? Yes. We okay. have uh, Carissa or Teresa. Okay. Hi, this is Carrie. Hello, it's Teresa Tide. I I love oh. her. I knew it was her. How are you, girlfriend? <laughs> I'm great. How are you, honey? I'm fantastic. I'm, I'm so glad that your business, you're back in business. This is from Yes, Teresa. I am. Yes, I am. Um, I, I, I support so, her 100%. Mm -hmm. Oh, and you know I support you 100% too, Carrie. Thank, Thank you. I have What's one that? question that I've baffled three doctors in the past week and a half, and nobody knows what's wrong with me. Okay. I have some serious pain going on in my lower left back. Yeah. We went through CAT scans, kidney stones. We, tried, we went through all of this, and nobody knows what's the problem. So now the doctors have me on all kinds of medication, and I don't want to take pills. So I was wondering oh. if there was any way you could, you know, see or I don't know. I don't know what's going on with me. I'm in Aaron's, a lot of pain. I know. You're in a lot of pain. Erin also talks about calcium deposits. Um, and there's something wrong with a dis that's pressing on something. Do you get sciatica ever too, or you're just in pain all the I, time? I'm just in pain all the time. I don't, you know, I never really had back problems, but no, it's the lower there's, left there's, back. There's, there's something going on there. Ter there's something because it's a pressure, and then there's calcium, and there, and it's and it's leaning up against something, and it's tucked way behind back there. So did they do a power gap? They're just talking about some kind of scan where they go around the body. Did you get something done around or just the back? Yeah, I mean, that, around the CAT scan. That went around the body. Okay. So was it anything by your, as far as your, your do you have any pressure on, on your lower back? Like when you, I know you have pain and pressure, but when I talk, when I breathe in and I breathe out, do you have, do you hurt? He wants to know if you hurt when you breathe. If you, when you bring the pressure of your back, when you bring your back, and when you go to lift your, there's a reason why he's asking this. When you bring your back in, does it hurt you? Like when you go to sit up with yeah. your posture. Okay. Yep. You ha okay, thank you. It's a contusion. There's a, there's a, it's a, a calcium deposit. I don't know what the word contusion means. Please look it up. But he said it's right there. When you go, when I pull on my back, it's so hidden, so tucked deep inside there that it's from, even when you stem from being a, a, a girl, a young girl, very young girl, something happened. He said, does something happen in order to, to keep it building, building? Do you drink a lot of, you, are you good with dairy? Are you, do you eat, are you with the dairy or do you, you lack dairy? No, I don't really do dairy. You're not good with milk, dear, and you're missing that all in your body. Calcium's totally, totally had it. So we need to work on that, too. You will fix the back. It will make it happen. But um, I, I just, there, there, but he mentions these two names, so just look it up, and, 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 and we'll oh, work wow. on it further. I'll text you. Thank you, Carrie. Well, if, Thank you yeah, so yeah, much. If, wow. if she comes back with some more stuff, then I'll, I'll, I'll definitely text you anyway. I'm going to see you anyway soon. 
So, all right, all right thank, thank you. Thank I you love so you and love keep you. it going. And I want to order gifts. So, how do I do that? Because you, I don't know if you've told any of us on the show, but if we want to buy a gift, and I love the idea of you know Christmas Hanukkah presents, and I've got right. a lot of people I'd like to buy these gifts for. How do I go about you know doing this with you? Do I just call well, you at another time or email you? You could just go to the website. It's above my head. Or go to www.carriepsychiccafe.com. Right. There is on it. On it, there is a. It says book a reading. When you go to a book of reading, you go on the PayPal down there. You don't need PayPal to do it. And you go put in it the gift. And it's $50. Or you can do the $10 for t- It doesn't matter whatever you do. Um, but right. you have to put the amount in and put you put what it is for. And then you just click on the bottom. And that's how they do it. It's that simple. That's terrific. Simple. I'm going to advertise that on my page. I never thought about that till just a few minutes ago. To order Christmas gifts is a fantastic idea for everybody. I, I Forget so. the toiletries everybody. and the ties and the stupid little candles, whatever it is. Order this. This is a true gift, everybody, if you're listening to me. A true gift. So Thank I'm going to put that on my Teresa's tie-dye page, too. It's a fabulous uh, idea. And thanks. we'll talk soon. And thank you so much again, Carrie. I love you. You're welcome. I love you too much. This is Teresa Tie-Dye. She's who made my beautiful background. If you want something this groovy like this, this chick is where to go. You can find her on Facebook at Teresa Tie-Dye. You could go. She could, she'll just take care of you. She did it. Stop for a while. Everybody got all weird with it. She's back. She's wonderful. And she's groovy, baby. I got a question. That talk to Chris. Wait, wait a minute, somebody just, yeah, one second. Um, this is really interesting. What? Uh, uh, Dennis had, had said to me, have you ever spoken to me, Tom, have you ever spoken to Carrie's guides as she would step aside and let them speak to you? This could be a, a real, like, mind-blowing experience for you because his wife used to somehow be able to let him do that. And I told him, I don't think unless they kick me in the butt, I would hear You them. have no gift, no. <laughs> but All we're right, going to try, t- though. It'll be something interesting, huh? Uh, let me talk to Chris, please. <laughs> oh, goodness. Yeah. Okay. Hey, Chris. You're funny. Hello, Carrie. This is Unique Hey. Chris. Hi, beautiful. How are you? I am all right. Mm-hmm. I How? have this really interesting experience. Okay. Uh, the first part, I nodded off taking a nap, and I was woke up by this voice of the same lady that sung to me at one time. Right. And then I went back to sleep mm-hmm. and I was visited by a man saying that he was so sorry for not looking for me for all these years and right. uh, said he was so, he felt like he was a ba- being a bad father. Right. For, wow. for not doing so. Wow. That was a, that was a that was a beautiful gift, just so you know. That that was that was an outstanding gift from somebody. Now I don't know if it's to be a verse to you, because thank you. My father said it, it, that might be information you need to tell somebody you meet down the road. And they're still talking about yeah, he doing. Yeah, hugged his... me. Mhm. Yeah, yeah, he had a real me gift. And I... Wow. Wow, Chris, you're you're so. If everybody don't know, this is unique, Chris. He's amazingly gifted. He's um came out with uh, a bunch of stuff that's been going on. He dreams. He, he visions. He he sees like Susanna's with the keyhole things. He he has a he's had long conversation with Susanna. Uh, but Chris is uh Chris is having a lot happen to him, and um it comes sometimes a lot in the sleep mode, or you know now it's even coming a little bit stronger in other parts. And he has a lot of past guides in him that is taking him to a new level in his life. And um, and we've been so honored enough in order to do this for almost a year now with him as far as, you know, calling in and, and, and experiencing this. And are you still doing your journal, Chris? Are you still writing all this down? Yes. Yeah, because it's going to be a screenplay one day. You know that. One day there's yeah, going to be... Yeah, I suspect different... man yeah. was a relative of mine before. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. It was a gift. That's what they said. Thank you. The garden said it's a gift. All of them agree. They love him. Wow. They love him. Um, they all agree it was a gift. They got want keep on writing, keep on doing it because that's going to be this the screenplay that we were talking about. Thank you. And they they want you to know that you also have to remember the breathe, dear. Remember the breathe. They want you to breathe. Aaron wants yeah, you. I to- think he was like great grandpa or something. I was going on to the grandfather in Ocean too. Um, but I'm also triggering off because my dad talks about it being also a gift of, of, of giving also. So it might be also a message for somebody else that you need to do when you come through 
in a different area of your life also, but it was a gift for you. Um, but you also might need to share it, my friend, if, if you get my meaning. So you might have to share yeah. that one day and, and, and you might have to, you know, give back the favor. It's called pay. It's called give forward. So give forward. But, um, you know, oh, I, wow. just, I just I just want you to understand that you need to keep the journals. You need to keep going with that because you're going to be very much connected with somebody that's going to want all that information to make it to the next level. So you got to stay with us. You got to stay with us. You got to stay strong. You got to keep healthy. You know, I know sleep is hard for you. Chris has that dead time is rough. So, um, but um, thank you for calling in. We love you so much. You're in the room. So if anybody wants to talk to Chris, please give him, you know, talk to him. You're, you can ask him what he dreams about, ask him what he journals. I mean, he's fantastic. Thank you so much for calling in. We love you very much, Chris. Thank I, you so much. Have a great holiday. Thank I you so you. much. Thank you. And, and just, just so you know, what? I, I have been asked, have I ever seen you leave your body and talk through another person. Absolutely. I said, yes, I have, and it's scary as heck. <laughs> <laughs> we have Thomas. one more. We have one more sure. call. Angela. That's perfect. Hi, Ange. Hi. Um, I have a question for you. Um sure. It's like, I, remember what we talked about last time? I'm, you're probably going, what? <laughs> um, about um, getting the information for Ralph. Yeah, I know. I know who you are. I know what's okay, going on. Um, What's Don't shock me today. <laughs> Don't turn off the lights, Ralph. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> he whacked us last time. Don't you remember? Holy crap. Yeah. Um, well, see, the, the thing um, that I'm I'm wondering is, does he still want me to go through with it? Because um, I feel as though, like, I have a lot of people that are telling me, like, your brother is so, such a horrible person, and it, it's not going to mean a thing to him. Absolutely nothing. It will hit home. Don't listen to that. Ralph, thank you. My father, so you, uh-uh, they're agreeable to this. This just can't be let out. I mean, you need to p- proceed as follows. It will clear a lot of things. I would not stop. Hey, um, I mean, you, I've been completely cut off from my family from the, for this. I understand, totally. I understand that. I understand that. But it's up to you and, whether you want to stop it or not. But I'm saying the journey's just begun. You're just opening up cans of worms, babe. So, you know, he's but very But does Ralph proud want me to? Yeah, he's very proud of you. I mean, there's not, well, there, there's not even, Jim, um, there's not even, a, no, oh, no, he don't want you to stop. But he said, it's totally up to you, babe. It's up to you, whatever you okay. want to do. He's, da- I mean, he's, he's yeah, with it's you like, 100%. It's very, it's, it's like draining my energy. And, and as a matter of fact, as I've been talking to this with my therapist, she told me to write a book. She said it will be a Absolutely. bestseller. Absolutely. <laughs> that is not a joke. Even from she even said, from I have the most dysfunctional <laughs> family he's ever heard of. <laughs> no, I thought ours were. Um, but uh, I think, and I think we're on the same page with that. But I'm also um, put the refrigerator in there. That's a great story too. Behind here. she had a refrigerator that was just hard. Remember the refrigerator? You still have the... <laughs> there was a story behind everything. Her house is a, amazing. But I would the, the, continue the journey. Um, but you should definitely should start the journal. I would so start the journal and start back from when you first met him would be great. Okay. Because that would take it to the whole spiritual right. level of what needs to be. Listen, you got to get in touch with Chris because she's not well. Yeah, I know. I know. I've been with she. We text each other all the time, and you know, right now I'm like so down. It's bad, and she, we're da- we're both as bad a down as each other can get. So I understand, we're just, but there's I think not, we just keep the, pushing each other like, up. Right, and I I need to push her up too. So you know, there there needs to be there needs to be some air here because I can't. It, it choked me up. I can't. The feeling that I feel is just so down in the dumps. And when the hell is it going to happen? And we need, you know, like I can't do this anymore. And I just we can't. We need to. Everybody needs to to pray and and, and get something done here. But um, so yeah. thank you for calling in, my dear. Uh, and thank you so much for everything. And um, you know, you're gonna All have right. to. Thank you so much. Thanks, Ellen. Thank you so much. Let's keep the prayers for everybody here, huh? All right. Okay. So thank you so thanks. much. For, thanks thank for you. Like it. All right. Thank you so much for everybody for calling in um, and, and chatting with us today and spending our awesome, awesome Sunday nights together here at Carrie Psychic Cafe. You Thursday. could, um, it's what? Yes, on Thursday, you can tune into my other show. It's Air One. It's Air One R. It's air. It's a one R psychic uh, radio. Um, they have a Facebook. It's Thursdays nine thirty, 
Eastern Standard Time. It's a radio, so you can get your readings done there. It's only a half an hour, so I'm going to let you know that. Um, you go to www.askoneradio.com. Um, the calling number is an 888 number. It's free also. So um, also I wanted to let a little shout out you my web, web my website blah blah www.carriepsychiccafe.com click on it you can get book a reading um there's a Christmas special fifty for twenty of uh, fifty for what is it twenty five minutes and then ten for ten which goes on through December um but you can do it by going to my website uh, and uh, basically you can Facebook or twit me twit me twit me twit me I'm almost done I'm shot blah blah blah. blah. All right, so we want to thank you so much. I, 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 I want to thank everybody. I want to thank Anna. I want to thank everybody. Our chat room is definitely blowing up today, right? Um, I want to thank everybody for their support and um, love and, 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 and commitment to the show. Uh, we love seeing you every Sunday, and we'll be back again next week. Same time, same channel, and doing it again and helping the world. Again, uh, we're here for offerings. It's just one question. Book a reading. By going above my head or going to www.carriepsychicafe.com. And um, we want to thank you. God bless and good night. You are tuned to the Nissan Communications Network. Our weekly lineup of call-in programs includes Computers 2K Now with Amnon Nissan, Sundays, 9 a.m. till noon. Carrie's Psychic Cafe with Carrie Silkowski, Sundays, 8 till 9 p.m. Health In with Debbie Brooke, Mondays, 11 a.m. till noon. Breaking Free with Marilyn Shannon, Mondays, 1 till 2 p.m. Lessons of Vietnam with NCVBI members the second and fourth Wednesday of each month from 7.30 till 8.30 p.m. Reawaken Your Brilliance with Julie Seibert, Wednesdays, 9 till 10 p.m. And if you tuned in too late, you can always watch each program in its entirety or download an MP3 audio file of it at www.nissancommunications.com Sponsored by thatvidblasterguy.com carolinaapparel.com, and deltaforce.net. All right.